University of Nairobi in partnership with Calro has innovated new methods aimed to reduce post-harvest losses for peanut farmers in Nyanza. Through the World Bank-funded Belt project, it has developed modern technologies to ensure quality food preservations in management of cereals and nut crops. Here we are promoting, for example, the pig's bags, which uh, ensures that moisture does not accumulate in the peanuts during storage. While addressing the press, the project manager, Professor Sheila Okoth, said that its objective is to intensify production and get maximum output within small-scale farmers. So that within a small farm, you can intensify production so that you get a lot of output. On his remarks, Carl Ross Research Officer Francis Zoyua added that the organization has embarked on reviving indigenous foods that are slowly diminishing to bridge the gap on food security and nutrition. Neglected and underutilized crop, finger millet and groundnuts. Because these crops, they are highly nutritious, but their cultivation is disappearing. Especially in these times that we have many diseases like COVID, how we can use these crops to improve the nutrition status. Meanwhile, the company has unveiled Alpha Felix product, a pesticide that controls the flotoxin levels in groundnuts and the cereal families at large. Alpha Safe is a biocontrol product developed by Calro, but in this uh, Everbelt project, we are trying efficacy trials to see if we can extend the same to groundnuts, sorghum, and finger millet. The Iwabelt project is currently implemented in Kisumu's Nyakach and Karachonyo in Homa Bay County. Reporting for Newsline from Kisumu County, my name is Grace Wafubwa.